Hi everybody, for today's episode, I'm going to tell you how I started and why I stayed in this genre, the kids and family portrait photography. Hi, my name is Stanley Ong. I'm a portrait photographer in the Philippines. I'm a Panasonic Lumix Philippine ambassador. I'm a Godox Philippine ambassador. I'm an instructor in a Philippine Center for Creative Imaging. I'm also a breastfeeding advocate photographer. And at the same time, I'm a dad. Back in... Uh, 2007, uh, that was the year uh, that I got married, and at the same time, it was the year where I had my first baby. And this was also the year that I entered the world of kids and family portrait photography. So that year, being a first-time parent, uh, being having a small, a new small family, um, and a new career, this gave me a drive to excel. Um, I wanted to be on top of my game, and at the same time, I wanted to grow, to learn and improve myself. So the question here is, uh, why did I stay? Uh, what gave me? that fuel you know, to maintain that energy and to still be shooting until today. In the beginning, uh, I only thought of it as a... I only wanted to step in to that genre, to that new industry, to that new world of kids and family portrait photography. So. So you can see it's just me, my family, my wife, my kid, my photography career. So that's all I was thinking of. And then I realized eventually the question is why? Why am I doing this? Why am I pushing myself? Why do I keep myself tired the whole day, still at it? At, at, after the shoot, keep myself busy. And even though it's a cycle, if you look at it, it's a cycle. Uh, you know, it's meeting a client, shooting them, meeting a pregnant woman, shooting a mother, giving, uh, doing a maternity session with them. Uh, it's, it's like it was repeating. So some photographers might feel that it's a repetition. It keeps on repeating. And then they get burned out. They get tired of what they're doing. But why, I'm still, why am I still here after more than 10 years of doing what I do? Because number one, I love what I'm doing. So look, let's look at it. What are this repeating repetition that I am talking about? Number one, this is what I do. I do maternity shoot. I meet uh, new, newly wed couple ha having their first baby, shooting them their maternity session, ha shooting their newborn session. And after a while, the toddler, the baby grows up into a toddler and then grows up to around five, seven. I'm still shooting them. And now I'm shooting the family. And at the same time, when the family grows, I start shooting the whole clan. As the, the siblings of mommy, the siblings of daddy, with grandpa and grandma. And then again, it goes to a cycle. I meet new clients, pregnant mom, new family, baby, and it goes around. But the question is, do I get bored? The answer there is definitely no. As a dad myself, I realize I could relate. 
As a new dad that time, I could relate to this new family, new couple, a newborn baby, a toddler. That time, I could relate what they're doing. I could relate their stories, how they couldn't sleep at night during their first two weeks, three weeks, one month with the baby. There was a, there was a connection between me and the parents. And for me, that was, that was very important. Not, I gained the parents' trust, and at the same time, I became friends with them. Not the mom opens up to me, the dad opens up to me, I tell them what I do, I give them suggestions, especially when it comes to breastfeeding. Or I had an, a lot of experience taking care of my wife and daughter during uh, their breastfeeding journey, and it helped me help other people. It's an honor for me when uh, they welcome me to their home. Uh, the ble it's for me. It's a blessing that I even get to be friends with the mommies and the daddies, and I cannot express how much I feel. Uh, I feel overwhelmed and. Most especially is I feel grateful for the time that the family are giving me. That they're giving me one or two hours that short of the time in their life. That's me, it's already so special. That's a special moment for me. And yes, it's a cycle, a repetition, yes. But at the end of the day, it's those moments, those memories that I capture, the unique memories, the unique sessions that I have with my clients, those image I produce for them, that's the drive that keeps me going until now. So those things, those simple things, you know, they whisper in my ears that says, hey, don't stop. Keep on going. Keep on learning. Keep on sharing my gift. I feel it's a gift that I can give towards the parents, the kids especially. When they grow up, they look at the image, and it's a gift. Uh, it's a precious gift that we can give to our kids. So thank you, mommies and daddies. I will uh, continue to do what I do best, and that is capturing all those special moments for you. So thank you very much for supporting me throughout the years and I will uh, uh, try to improve myself, better myself, so I can continue giving you unique images for your families and for your kids. Thank you very much. If you've enjoyed this sh short episode, please do subscribe. I'll be coming out with more episodes with probably guests or more on kids and portrait photography. Thank you again and see you next time.